think when we will be in a fit state of mind to play tomorrow after all the headlines? So we'll ask the coach, yes, he will play. We play and uh, I spoke with him and uh, I monitored him uh, during the two days after uh, the game against Hungary and uh, he was really, really good on the pitch and uh, he will be also in good situation tomorrow because uh, I hope the performance of Rooney tomorrow will be the same that uh, I saw in Wembley. Yeah, I've, I've spoken to him today at lunchtime and, and trained with him yesterday and um, Wayne's been fine and he's looking forward to the game and, and looking forward to playing well. You know, I've known Wayne for a long time. Um, he loves playing football. Um, yeah, he's got an issue off the pitch, but I don't think that'll stop him from playing well tomorrow night. Sometimes you've got an issue off the, off the field. You know, football can be a release from that and, um, you know, once the game starts, I'm sure Wayne will be focused on um, playing well himself and doing a job for the team so we get three points here. The players know what uh, you have to do during the um, private life. And, uh, but it's private life. I am a manager, they are players, you have to, you have to play to win. For the reason, I, I think it's better to, to separate the different uh, moments. You know, all the players understand what we're here for. We're here to um, try and get three points against a, a very good team. Um, you know, we're, we're confident at the moment after the result the other night. and um, It's important that we're not distracted by anything, not just um, the issue with Wayne. You'll have to make one change because of Michael Dawson's injury, yeah. but will you try and keep the rest of the side the same as, as the one that started against Bulgaria? Mm, I have, um, I mean, yes, more or less, but uh, I have to decide uh, the centre back. I don't know if uh, between Kyle, Abson, uh, Lescott. I don't think you'd have to change much, much after a 4 0 win, and uh, the way the boys played the other night was fantastic. Um, but, you know, whatever he decides to do in central defence, I'm confident that the lads will do a good job. You know, Gary came on the other night and uh, stood up to the task well. and. Um, done himself no harm at all and obviously Matthew's got the experience he played throughout the, the World Cup qualifying campaign and um, done a superb job for us. Every victory is uh, really, really important uh, and uh, in Switzerland will be really important because uh, I think it's one of the best of the group, uh, the best team of the group and the stronger team of the group but uh, all the, the games that you have to play, you have to win, because um, this group is really balanced. Switzerland are a good team, uh, very, very organised defensively. Um, you know, difficult to score against. So, of course, a winner uh, will do wonders for our confidence. As I say, um, the lads are feeling good and really happy with the performance tonight. But we want to build on that. Uh, we understand, you know, not to get carried away. My target is uh, to play the Euros. And uh, to play the Euros, it's important to arrive first in the group because uh, if you want to play the Euros, you have to, to win games, uh, all the games, or minimum, you have to draw away. That was the plan when we first joined up last week, was to take six points. Um, I think a draw here would be a decent result, but a win would be fantastic and you know, we're after three points.